Hi there, in this video I'm going to show you how to add a shadow or a drop shadow to your text whether it's a stylistic choice or to make your text much more visible. The first thing that you want to do is log into canva.com and once you do that go where it says create a design. So you can do a custom size depending on where you're uploading it on a website or on social media. It all depends on you. In this case I'm going to choose the square Instagram post because it's usually the easiest. It's a 10 by 80, 1080 by 1080 dimensions so you choose the ones that work for you. You. I'm just going to click on it and then it will give you a blank canvas. So you can just use a blank canvas just like this and you can put any photos or anything of that sort or of that nature. You can pick a background where you know that your text is going to stand out. In this case I just chose a gradient just like this one. You can change colors or do whatever that you want. Go here where it says text and then you add a text style. So it depends on what you want to do. I'll just pick that one. You just click on the template or whatever that you want to work on and then you're just going to leave this text written baby boy. So you can change the size, the font, anything that you want to change it to but I'm just going to leave it like this and then I'm going to extend it so that it is large enough to be seen so that whenever we add shadows or any effects then it's definitely going to show. Then you go to this banner on top where it says effects. You just tap on effects and then you get all the styles that you want. So you can click on shadow or you can click on lift. It does different things. Once you click on the shadow or any effect that you want, there is different things that you can go to. You can offset so that you can add a specific shadow to the text. You can change the direction that you want the shadow to go to and you can also change the transparency by increasing it or decreasing it depending on how you want your text to be seen. You can also change the color. Maybe the black is just a bit too much. You can change it to white so that it stands out and then your shadow really stands out as well. When we go back to effects, you can change the color of the shadow itself. So if you want it to be a pink shadow, it's not going to show anymore. If you want it to be purple, you want it to be a different color, you can definitely change the different color. Look how different that looks by just changing the different colors. So you just go with the complementary colors that work with anything that you are working on. I like the orange. It makes the text stand out. So this is the way you can add shadow to any text that you add in Canva and it's nice and easy. Let me know if you have any questions in the comments down below and I'll definitely answer them. Otherwise, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and like and I'll see you in my next video.